Doppler 18 forecast with meteorologist Jesse Hawila. Weather from where you live. Well, it was an awesome day out there. We had temperatures well above average with highs in the mid to upper 60s all across the region. And here's why. This vigorous low pressure system here that's now swirling its way through parts of southern Wisconsin and northern Illinois just kind of filtered in this very warm air, but it's not going to last for too long. We're going to get on the other side of this system. As you can see, it's already starting to work its way to the east. And we're going to cool down a little bit tonight with increasing cloud cover this evening. And that's actually showing up on RINCAM. You can see some cloud now starting to move into the area. And that's going to continue to happen through the overnight hours. And since we've lost the sun, we've dropped it down just a little bit. It's still warm out there, 63 degrees. And the reason it's still warm is we still have these gusty winds uh, sustained right now southwest 14 miles per hour. Now our peak wind gust today here in Lafayette just occurred last hour. We had a peak wind gust at 46 miles per hour and you can hear it here in the studio. Uh, the walls are shaking here 45 miles per hour for the peak wind gust in Frankfurt, 37 in Rensselaer and a peak wind gust of 33 miles per hour earlier this evening in Logan's Point. Now here's what satellite radar looks like. You can see here's the cloud cover that's starting to build into the area and it's showing up really well here on satellite and it's going to continue to move its way east but it's not going to last for too long. The cloud cover will stick around through the overnight hours as you can see on Futurecast through the early part of tomorrow morning. And as we get on the backside of that cold front, we will cool down a little bit. Not too bad though. Lows tonight in the lower 30s for most of us here. 31 for the low in Logansport and Monticello. Mid 30s the farther south you are. 34 for the low tonight in Perrysville. Now here's Futurecast tomorrow morning through tomorrow evening. Notice the clearing trend as these clouds start to scoot their way off to the east. So we can expect to see some sunshine tomorrow. Again, it will be mostly cloudy in the morning by 9 o'clock. We'll be right around 38 degrees, and these winds still will be gusty, but they will calm down just a little bit, 10 to 15 miles per hour by lunchtime, a temperature right around 45, and we'll work our way up to a high in the lower 50s for most of us, 51 for the high here in Lafayette. You're going to struggle through the upper 40s in the far northern counties, 49 for the high in Winnemac and Rochester, and 51 degrees for the high in Burlington. Now, here's Thursday evening through Friday morning. Not a lot going on uh, during this time period, but this is what we're going to be tracking for the chance for some thunderstorms come Friday afternoon. This system here is going to track its way up through parts of central Illinois into Indiana, and that's going to bring us a risk for some thunderstorms. And a few of those right now look like they could be on the strong to possibly severe side. We'll keep tracking that again tonight. 33 degrees for the low, a little bit chilly. Not too bad, though. We'll rebound to the lower 50s, 51 degrees. A pleasant day tomorrow. We will get rid of the cloud cover that you'll see in the morning. And guys, we're going for another 65 degrees on Friday. Again, that's when the shower and thunderstorm chances increase. A few of those could be strong. And then behind that cold front, we cool it back down into the 40s. 41 for the high on Sunday with another chance of rain. And then up we go again. Tuesday, 60, 60 degrees and 64 on Wednesday. And that's going to be in advance of another cold front. So here's spring. Yeah, yeah. quite the roller coaster already. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, that's how it's been all winter. And uh, right. this is a little more fun with 60s, right? Yeah, well, we're heading in the right direction for today. sure. All right, thanks, Jesse. Jesse.